Today, we're going to be talking about Psalm chapter 16, verse 11, which says, You will show me the path of life, in your presence is fullness of joy. At your right hand are pleasures forevermore. What does this verse mean? This verse is a beautiful declaration of the joy that we can find in God's presence. The psalmist says that God will show us the path of life and that in his presence there is fullness of joy. This means that when we follow God's leading, we will find true happiness and fulfillment. The word fullness here is the Hebrew word shalomit, which means completeness or wholeness. So, when the psalmist says that there is fullness of joy in God's presence, he means that we will find a complete and satisfying joy that nothing else in the world can offer. Why is God's presence so joyful? There are a few reasons why God's presence is so joyful. First, because God is love and love is the source of all joy. When we are in God's presence, we are surrounded by love and this love fills us with joy. Second, because God is perfect and being in his presence means being in the presence of perfection. This perfection is awe-inspiring and exhilarating and it fills us with joy. Third, because God is holy and being in his presence means being in the presence of holiness. This holiness is cleansing and purifying and it fills us with joy. What does this verse mean for us? This verse means that we can find true joy in God's presence. When we follow God's leading, we will find a complete and satisfying joy that nothing else in the world can offer. What does this verse mean for us? Spend time in prayer and worship. When we focus on God and His goodness, we are drawn into His presence and we experience His joy. Read the Bible. The Bible is full of stories about God's love, perfection, and holiness, and these stories can help us to connect with God and experience His joy. Serve others when we serve others. We are following God's leading and we are also experiencing the joy of giving and helping others. One Bible story that illustrates the joy of God's presence is the story of Mary and Martha in Luke chapter 10 verse 38 to 42. In this story, Jesus visits Mary and Martha's home and Mary sits at Jesus' feet and listens to him teach while Martha is busy preparing a meal. Martha becomes frustrated with Mary for not helping her. But Jesus rebukes Martha and tells her that Mary has chosen the good part, which is to sit at his feet and learn from him. This story shows us that the joy of God's presence is more important than anything else in the world. Even though Martha was busy with important tasks, she was missing out on the greatest joy of all, which was spending time with Jesus. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, I come to you today in the name of Jesus Christ. I thank you for your great goodness towards me and for the many blessings that you shower on me day by day. I pray that you would help me to keep my eyes trained on you and to find my joy in your presence. I know that in your presence is fullness of joy and at your right hand are pleasures forevermore. Help me to walk in your ways and to follow your leading. I pray that you would show me the path of life and that I would find true satisfaction in you alone. Thank you for your love and your grace. I praise you for your faithfulness and I trust you with my life. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video about Psalm 1611. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them below and be sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one.